The Guide for Identifying Evidence-Based Interventions for School Improvement is intended to help local education agencies, LEAs, or schools carefully consider the evidence supporting interventions to be included in school improvement plans as required by the Every Student Succeeds Act, or ESSA. These interventions may be selected from a menu of options provided by the State Education Agency, SEA, or, if the SEA allows flexibility, the LEA or school may choose to consider a variety of interventions. The purposes of this guide are to help LEAs or schools evaluate the evidence base for interventions as they identify those to be included in school improvement plans for schools in need of comprehensive or targeted support, Determine the interventions that have strong evidence and are relevant and appropriate to meeting the needs of the school. And plan to provide resources for schools that will be needed for successful implementation. Self-study is a decision-making process conducted by a team of LEA staff who are led by a chosen facilitator. The process involves preparation, discussion, and planning. All tools that are utilized during the self-study may be completed electronically or can be printed and filled out by hand. Step 1 is Preparation. Begin with building the team that will work through the self-study process. The team may include school improvement specialists, content or grade level teachers, exceptional student education and English language learner teachers, as well as those involved in professional development and leaders at the district and school level. The broader the range of knowledge and skills reflected on a team, the better. Team members individually review research and identify one or more evidence-based interventions to present to the team. If the LEA or school must choose from an SEA-developed list, they should choose an intervention from that list. If they have flexibility, the LEA or school may choose any intervention they wish to investigate and present to the team. The team may also review and rate sample interventions included in the guide. If the LEA or school must choose from a list, they should only rate the interventions that also appear on the list. If they have flexibility, the team may rate any or all of the sample interventions provided. The LEA or school scoring template contains fields where team members may enter the school improvement area, the name of an intervention in that area, the evidence level according to ESSA, strong, moderate, or promising, a summary of the research, and any additional information that should be considered, guiding questions that may provoke team discussion, and a place to enter citations. After considering the information available, team members individually rate each intervention as not recommended, recommended, or strongly recommended. The LEA or School Scoring Guide provides samples of interventions based on the following five areas which research shows as being important to school improvement. These include implementing systemic change, establishing strong leadership, improving academic instruction, developing and retaining a high quality staff, and creating a positive school climate and culture. The scoring guide contains examples of interventions in each area, the ESSA evidence level, a summary of research, additional information that teams may wish to consider, and guiding questions that may be helpful in determining a rating for the intervention. Team members individually rate each intervention as not recommended, recommended, or strongly recommended. Step 2 is Discussion. After the LEA or school scoring templates and LEA or school scoring guides have been completed, a facilitator guides the team through a voting process and discussion of the interventions and individual ratings. This promotes thoughtful consideration of interventions the LEA or school may wish to implement. The facilitator uses the LEA or school voting and consensus rating form to record the team's recommendation for each intervention after the team votes, engages in discussion, and comes to consensus. The final step in the self-study process is planning. The guiding questions in the LEA or school scoring guide, along with the discussion of each intervention, may lead to a conversation regarding priorities, implementation, challenges, and resources that should be provided to schools. The LEA or school planning form is used to record priorities, ideas regarding implementation and resource development necessary for schools to be successful, and any anticipated challenges.
The facilitator leads the discussion centered on these topics and uses the form to capture ideas and to establish timelines and responsibilities for team members. Additional tools in the self-study guide include Appendix A, an annotated bibliography which correlates to each of the areas in the scoring guide, and Appendix B, which provides a description of theory of action and an example of a logic model. References are also provided in the guide. For more information, visit essa.fsu.edu.